legendary heroes and mythical creatures, starting off with the Greeks and their craft that portrayed such. The Greek vase, or as they call it, vaso. For the ancient Greeks, vases were mostly functional objects made to be used, not just admired. They used ceramic vessels in every aspect of their daily lives for storage, carrying, mixing, serving, and drinking, and even as cosmetic and perfume containers. Elaborately formed and decorated, vases were considered worthy gifts, made of terracotta or fired clay, Ancient Greek pots and cups, or vases as they are normally called, were fashioned into a variety of shapes and sizes, and very often a vessel's form correlates with its intended function. For example, a Corinthian alabastron vase, shown here, depicts two lions and an owl. These vessels were used for storing perfumes and fine oils. The amphora, is one of the most common forms in Greek pottery, various shapes always with two vertical neck handles and used for storing and transporting oil, wine, and foodstuffs such as olives. On the exterior, Greek vases exhibit painted compositions that often reflect the style of a certain period, during the archaic and classical periods in particular. Vase paintings primarily display human and mythological activities. These scenes can vary widely, from daily life events to heroic deeds and Homeric tales, from the world of the heroes to theatrical performances and athletic competitions. While it is important to stress that such painted scenes should not be thought of as photographs that document reality, they can still aid in reconstructing the lives and beliefs of the ancient Greeks. This week, we will try to design a Greek vase using the features mentioned. We will also use patterns which we normally found in Greek designs. To make this more interesting, we can play the game Roll a Greek Vase. If you have a dice at home, you can use that and this sheet to play. If you don't have a dice at home, you may use the lottery way. Prepare six pieces of small paper, each labeled with the numbers 1 to 6 and put them in a container. Each time you need to roll a dice, just pick a number from the container and you're all set. However, since this is creative arts, the rules are not rigid. You can still add later what you think is best for your design. Are you ready? <music> 